Hey guys, it's Meg here from Run Fit Kin. I hope you're all having a happy April 1st. I will be attempting to vlog every day for the month of April with a couple of the fitness folks who I know through Fitfluential. So uh, hopefully you'll be tuning into my channel and seeing what I have to provide, have to share with you throughout the month. Today I want to talk about Open Wad 13.4. For those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, I'm talking about the CrossFit Open. The CrossFit Open is a competition that takes place throughout the world. Anyone can join in. All you have to do is do the workout that is prescribed and then submit your scores by Sunday. The workout is unknown until Wednesday when it's announced in a big way by major competitors doing it right on the spot as soon as it's announced. And um, it's been really fun being part of it this year. This is my first year doing it. As a first-time competitor, even though I have been doing CrossFit for two years, I am at the very bottom of most leaderboards. I knew going in that this was going to be difficult, and I knew going in that the weights were going to be pretty hard for me. And so I'm happy with what I've been doing for the most part. I really wish I could have gotten through the wall balls on 13.3, on um, and I really wish I had gotten more than one rep on my last attempt uh, at 13.3. Four. Uh, here, take a look at how that went for me. There you go. Split. Split. Stay tight. Get low. So a lot of the wad looks like that for me, where I would clean it up and not be able to drop under it. And as you can see, if you're a crossfitter, you'll see a lot of my form imperfections. First of all, I clean and I jump so wide when I clean. Uh, secondly, I dip low, too low, and stay there. I get stuck there. Um, 95 pounds is a lot for me. It's 80-something percent of my body weight. And uh, that is really hard for me to get over my head. I just wasn't using my hips powerfully enough. Um, I wasn't dipping and driving like you're supposed to. I did get one rep and here's what it looked like. And that looks painful. That was actually just as it was coming down. I got it up really quickly and um, I was dropping it down. So that wasn't the full range of motion. I did get the full range of motion on it. Um, the video, the person who was shooting the video just didn't get it um, at that moment. She had just started rolling when I had popped it up. Um, I did try again. There was like 10 seconds left with uh, one more try attempt and uh, it didn't work out for me. So one rep on 13.4. It's going to be a great measurement to see how far I've come in 2013. So that is my mini report on the CrossFit Open and how I'm doing. And uh, I'll have more for you, probably CrossFit related, over the next couple of days. I really hope that I can attempt to actually vlog every day. I'm going to try to keep it short so I don't kill you guys. Uh, thanks so much for tuning in. Subscribe if you like this. Give me a thumbs up if you like it as well. Check out my blog too. I will be posting a larger recap of how my entire box did um, on this wad. You can see some impressive feats done by other people um, from my gym. Thanks. See you later.